It's Friday, Friday. Ah! Today we're gonna do our crazy hairstyle. And you've got music class today. What a fun day. The 29th of May. That means it's the last Friday in May. That means it's Eden's last day, right? Eden, we're gonna miss you. All your friends are gonna come back, but not you. So yesterday, we were doing our O sounds, our short and long vowel, like O oh or O. And now we're gonna do the same thing, but with letter E. Here's an example. Eh, eh. Eh is the short sound for E. How about E? E. That's the long sound, especially if we put two E's together. So here, it's his leg. Le, egg. Eh sound. So that means it's just one E. Le, egg. Le, egg. It's leg. So we're gonna circle leg. This is a weed, weed. Do you know what a weed is? It's like a plant that's growing in your garden, but it's not the real flower. So you know when we were growing the carrots and I said to you, oh, you can pull that one out. That's not a real carrot, that's a weed. So it's another plant that will come in and will eat all the food of the plant that if you don't take it out, then your maybe your vegetable will not grow. So, e sound is two e's together. It's not a wet. It's a weed. Okay. This is a vet who helps animals. Ten feet bed. This is a den. Sheep wet and book. It's not a book. It says peak. It's like peekaboo, peekaboo, peeka, 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 boo. So that's two E's. I want you to circle the correct word. And then let's see what's next on Friday. Ooh. Tricky mat sheet. So we call this an activity mat. It means there's many different activities for you to try. You don't need to do all of them. And some of them, maybe you can't do because you don't have coins in your country. Cambodia doesn't have coins, but I know Thailand does. So maybe Jado can do it, or if you're in Australia, you can do it. This one is year one, okay? So this one is for around six years old. Five turning six. So that's like lion's age or even older. So if you can't do it, it's okay. But you can at least try and mommy and daddy can help you. Like this one. Imagine seeing one elephant in the zoo. How many legs can you see? You just need to write the number. How many legs does an elephant have? Yes, four. Okay, this one says write a number sequence. So that is a sum. It is three plus three. Three plus three. Okay, then we can count how many beads are there. 3 plus 3 equals 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay? Let teacher write that one for you. Oh, I cannot. My pen is gone. Never mind. If today is Monday, what is tomorrow? Okay? So that one you maybe need to sing the song. Sunday and a Monday, a Tuesday and a Wednesday, a Thursday and a Friday, and then the Saturday. Okay, so what comes after Monday? It's Tuesday. Very good. Okay, 
these are tricky 3D shapes. So you might not have heard of a triangular prism before, but you know a cube is like a dice, okay? Shh. Triangular prism. Later we're gonna learn all the 3D shapes, like cone and cube. Now that you can know many of the 2D shapes, like uh, square, circle, heart, things like that. This one says, which jug is full? So do you know what full and empty means? Like, if my water bottle has all the water in it, it's still full. If I drink all the water, it becomes empty. And if I start to drink some, halfway, you can call it half full or half empty. So we want to look at these jugs and you need to tick which one is full. It means all the way full of the orange juice. Okay? One more. We've done a little bit of practice with telling the time. Do you remember the big hand is on the 12 if we're talking about a clock? The big hand is always on the 12 and the small hand goes on what hour is it? So if it's three o'clock, you need to do the big hand on the 12 and the small hand on the three. So if it is four o'clock, how are you gonna do it? You need the big hand on the 12 and the small hand on the four. And then that will make it four o'clock. Okay. Whew. Do you need a bit of a brain break? Ugh. Let's have a look at some speaking practice. So yesterday you had conversation with your parents about different topics. Today we're going to talk about ourselves. Do you remember we've been doing? We are all different. And then we're going to talk about ourselves. What makes us different? And you can do this with a partner. So you can do it with your mummy, you can do it with your daddy, your brother, or your sister. You can do it with teacher on video if you want. It says describe your hair. So talk about your hair. Like teacher Tara's hair is now messy. In the morning it was lovely, now it's super messy. If your hair is curly or straight, long or short, that's what describe means. Talk about something. This one says describe your skin. So talk about your skin. We practiced yesterday, right? Some of you said peach color, yellow, pink, a little bit white, a little bit brown. Describe your skin. Who do you live with? Do you have pets? Which languages do you speak? Did you see yesterday's video? Konnichiwa, bonjour, hello. What's your favorite fruit? Do you remember teacher Tara's favorite fruits? I have a lot. I like mango, purple dragon fruit, papaya. I like all the berries like strawberry, I like cherry, I love peach, apricot, plum. Mm, I think I love all of them. What's your favorite fruit? Do you have any brothers or sisters? What is your hobby? Hobby is something you like to do when you have free time. What is your favorite color? Do you remember mine? Tiger has the same favorite colors as me. Purple and pink. What is your favorite type of weather? Okay, I hope you speak in English for that one. You need to practice your English, okay? Try not to speak Japanese or Chinese. And then, wow, 
Look at this beautiful owl. Look how colourful he is. So he's made of shapes, 2D shapes. What shapes can you see here? Can you see a triangle? And can you see circles? And what colours can you see here? We're going to make that owl. And then if you have these ingredients at home, you can make your owl on toast. So again, you can use whatever ingredients you have at home. You just need some bread. This one here has chocolate spread like Nutella on it. It uses banana for the eyes. It uses blueberries and apple and strawberry. But of course, if you don't have that, you can use whatever you have at home to make it. Maybe you don't have a chocolate spread, but you've got jam. Maybe you can use, you can have a cookie and break your cookie in half for the wings. What could you use for the eyes if you don't have blueberries? Maybe you have some sultanas at home or chocolate chip. Okay, I want you to make that owl if you can and show teacher, okay? And then, Did you know that there were so many different types of hair? So today we're not going to have the normal story time and you know we don't have Zoom because in the morning because of music class. So we're just going to have one special Zoom at 3 o'clock where you can show me your craziest hair, okay? You can make your hair stand up or a colour or a silly hat. I can't wait to see you at 3 o'clock with your funny hair, okay? See you later guys, have a nice day and enjoy music class.